well. Uh, fuck are the mics? Oh, right there. Okay, cool. So I just leave my leave my hand there. Uh, yeah. So uh, got ourselves a little little vlogging camera here. Uh, thing is super tiny. It's a bit rainy outside, so you know it is what it is. But we got a couple of bugs. Uh, I mean, the image is great. It is what you expect it to be. If you're used to the Pocket 4K, it's exactly the same. Um, the thing that I have found, there's a bug with the Jarver data. It lags about 50 milliseconds, so we have to manually align it. So, uh, future editor Joe here. Um, so, a couple issues I've found. Uh, and noticed, I just mentioned that the Jarver data seems to be lagging by about 50 milliseconds. Unfortunately, that 50 milliseconds seems to be very variable, um, anywhere between 40 and 60 milliseconds. And Jarrowflow has a really difficult time, like getting all of, for whatever reason, like this particular video has a lot of variability in it. And so you might notice little tiny jitters here and there where the sync points didn't quite match up uh, perfectly, where the confidence wasn't as high. So, um, oh, what was that? Oh my God, is it happening? Uh, yeah, so this needs a firmware update. I've already put in a ticket with Blackmagic support. I know Adrian Eddy, the creator of Jarrowflow, is aware of it. Um, nobody has any solutions right now. This camera's been out for a while, and you'd think it would have been included in the camera 8.6 firmware, but it was not. Um, hopefully, they'll add it in the next beta. Um, I'm, I'm pretty sure they're aware of the issue. I'm not the only person who's been complaining about it. But anyway, if you buy this camera and you want to use it on a drone, be aware it's going to take a lot of work and it's going to be very fiddly. So, yes. Um, anyway, back to the video. Which means you can only use it with the Java Flow right now. We can't use it with Dimension Resolve. Uh, you know, small issue, but considering I need to be able to gyro stabilize against some vibrations from a drone, uh, it's going to be a little bit of a, a little bit of a pain. So, uh, yeah, but uh, you know, other things like compared to the Pocket 4K, this thing sips batteries. Uh, get about an hour out of an 1800 milliamp hour uh, Canon battery, which is nice. Um, and uh, the menu system's not hard to use. Took a little bit of getting used to. Um, Always having a monitor around is going to be kind of crucial to make adjustments. Um, I think eventually I'll just be able to math it. I'll be like, well, you know, I, I want to be able to control the exposure with ND filters and lenses. So, um, yeah, it's pissing rain a little bit here. But, uh, yeah, uh, so far I really like it. And I uh, can't wait to get into the air. But the weather is shit. It's freezing outside. It's pissing rain, as you guys can see. So, um, hopefully, uh, hopefully this turns out okay. Anyway, love you. Bye.